another race and it's coming up this weekend last world cup tour race poker hide in the netherlands this is a muddy one this is a wet one wow um i can't even begin to explain to you like how exciting this race is um it's the last world cup race last opportunity for points um in 2020 listen to brand and mike um Michael uh, Vanderpool won that race, and then uh, Tunarts and uh, Emery Worst took second. So, you know, are there going to be any surprises this weekend? Not really sure. Of course, there's going to be mud, as you see in the clip. Um, but they did cancel, Gregor, and I'm sure you're seeing this with all the traveling you're doing in Europe. They are going to be canceling the juniors men and junior women, as well as U23 yeah. races. And, well, and yeah, this that's is true. something that we saw. We saw how much those juniors and the, uh, the that racing suffered in 2020 due to coronavirus, and let's hope things get sped back up again soon. How are things going to play out? Of course, with Matthew Vanderpool uh, not doing well, out of action, and and then how are things leading up without Walt Van Walt Van Aert uh, going over to the World Championships and just Tom Pitcock. I mean, I, I think we were talking last week, Pitcock's going to be our man, and there's uh, there might be some uh, money on that one. But, uh, you know, it leaves it wide open. Ellie Ezerby right now, as well as Lucinda Brand, are leading in the points um, positions for the leader's jersey, so by a pretty substantial margin. So unless something changes, the rankings are going to be as they fall, which means, you know, this could be, of course, Ellie, he's not going to Worlds, correct? So there's this whole thing where Todd, Tom is going to be our guy, or at least the guy that we're putting money on. Um, but yeah, this upcoming weekend, um, live and on demand in the US and Canada, Hoger Hyde, um, there won't be any spectators. So for those of you in Europe, this is your opportunity to see the race, um, or you know, rather just to get a feel for the last race before Worlds. And um, of course, we're really excited to see how it plays out and to see everybody's last minute preparations for Worlds. And we'll see you there next week.